Pre-diabetes is when your insulin levels are running so high, but your sugars are still okay because it's just taking a whole lot of insulin to keep your sugars under control. Based on an article published by Cleveland Clinic, this situation arises because it takes an excessive amount of insulin to manage your blood sugar effectively. However, once your blood sugar levels become uncontrollable, your insulin can no longer keep them in check, and that's when you transition to diabetes. When a patient develops diabetes, medical procedures such as angiograms and CT scans become necessary to assess the extent of arterial blockages. It's essential to understand that these arterial issues don't develop overnight. They accumulate gradually. In fact, you've earned these complications through years of living with prediabetes. This information should serve as a wake-up call, as it takes a substantial 10 to 15 years for prediabetes to progress into full-fledged diabetes. This process typically begins in your 30s and 40s, driven by a combination of unhealthy lifestyle choices, excessive sugar consumption, and frequent eating patterns, all of which lead to hyperinsulinemia, high insulin levels. As a result, your body requires increasingly higher levels of insulin to manage your blood sugar after each meal. Over time, your insulin production only continues to rise. Why? Because your body is becoming more and more resistant to the effects of insulin. It's important to note that this isn't medical guidance. 